there are two prayer warriors in your life your mind and your mouth are both praying that God is a listener to two dimensions of prayer request the one that comes from your lips change my life and the one your mind says don't bother again Lord I'm comfortable is saying that God is able to do whatever they are saying were you ever taught that your mind is a prayer warrior that it consistently sends requests about your destiny to the throne can do above all we ask not and think or think so could your situation be an answered prayer is it possible that the lack of growth is God honoring you for the several requests that continue to go from your mind to heaven keep us this way oh God and he says I gave you a will and I must honor it your mouth says i'm rising but your mind says it's all right just i changed my mind are we together they limited the holy one they limited the holy one the holy one wanting to reveal his multifaceted possibilities but the channel that gives him expression to the earth realm was limited by a man's understanding this is very powerful believers hear me many spiritual people will never succeed because of this simple reason success is not really in doing success is attracted by the transition that happens in your mind which is a reflection of what you are becoming every realm of spiritual understanding and mental development has possibilities that accrue to that realm an attempt to attract a reality that is higher than your mental level is only like pulling a rubber ring it will go back that's why many of our results are short-lived they did not come with growth they only came with desire and sometimes ego if you have 200 members and there are 1,000 members here, it's impossible for them to remain 200. They must match. It's a law. Not invented by science. Invented and maintained by God's own integrity. Show me a man who stays in one tiny room with no privilege. Let your mind... You see, the beautiful thing is that you don't need a visa to travel here you don't need to go to any consular office you can dream with God and he takes you to that realm this is the technology of growth the Holy Ghost takes your mind to your future the moment your mind gets there it comes and takes your body to go and join it so anywhere listen when you stop moving is because your mind stopped traveling please believe what i'm telling you realities are first fear a man who has arrived in his mind because god testifying said no power in existence sustains the ability to stop such a man could that man be you this morning who has gone with God to dimensions I know that it looks like nothing good can come out of Nazareth I know as it is right now there's no testimony hmm. Nathaniel said can anything good come out of Nazareth and Jesus at age 12 was in the temple traveling traveling the word traveling hmm. please listen to me if you're a businessman here this is a very powerful secret it will never come just by trying to you know do a lot of physical things leave all of that you don't need to be embarrassed that you cannot buy the shoe now there's no shame there anybody who laughs at you is ignorant and they do not understand the power of transition that comes in life why fake what can be real stay and travel with God and watch him lift you sometimes overnight is God speaking to us
any successful person who is very honest and open with you will tell you that once upon a time they never they they did not know how this will happen all they knew was that god said it and i believe it and he begins to indoctrinate their understanding that's why he shows you dreams because we think in pictures when your mind captures it it's impossible for you to leave it so whilst you are sitting here he shows you the nations watching you minister watching your products go beyond the shores of this country and africa and while he's doing that you don't know anybody while he's doing that not even your neighbor is interested in what you offer don't mind your neighbor he doesn't hate you he's only ignorant finish your business with god and i tell you a generation will stand as attention to honor the god see please listen 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 you stop being angry at your environment the real secret of success is you and God not what you do who you are what you do will continue to become who you are that's why promotion never blesses people sustainably they grow I'm, I'm not insulting you a lot of people say once I'm promoted then they are promoted and then nothing really happens then they change a job nothing really happens because the law is that it will always reflect you but grow here leave the chains around you just keep growing and you watch the power of the laws of the spirit he has broken the gates of brass and cut the bars of iron in sunder is there any chain that can hold a man who has grown out here if i capture your hands and i lock you in prison and you are mandela even after 20 years you are a president a president is a president and you will come out and truly be it so when they took the body of joseph to the prison they didn't know that it was only the body that was there the mind continued to dream i'm a savior i'm a lifter this is the cure for the anger that we have about our background why did my mother marry my father did she see him all of that 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 is not only sinful it's unnecessary Are we together? There is a bailout system. One simple law. Dream with God. That whilst you are standing here, I may not have the transport to go back, but I'm not ashamed. Listen, don't rush where you are. You will miss where you are living today. A day will come, you will turn back. If you ever tell people you were here, they would not believe you. Or enjoy the process with honor while you move because you know inevitably you are on your way going. Oh yes yes it's true it's true it's true it's true that men
that transitions and translations are still real it is true that people continue to upgrade to higher versions of themselves don't be ashamed of your pain don't be ashamed of the bills don't be ashamed of the tears if you need to cry 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 while your mind travels because it's about to pick your body some of you while you are sitting in this conference just right now your mind has already gotten there and is holding your body no power hear me there is no divination and no enchantment that sustains the ability to keep a man down who has gone up these are the justice systems of god it is proof that he is just and one lord who is rich unto all I can find my way out of life it may not be a cause that your mother didn't go to school it is not a cause that your father was not educated it's, it's not a cause that out of 12 siblings you are the first to ever rise he takes you here while they laugh yes Jesus died but he only died for three days he didn't die forever while they were laughing at the dead Jesus, a newer version was already up. The same way they laugh at you, he said, Rejoice not over me, my enemies. I know I came to Lagos and you met me under the bridge last week. Last week is not today, oh, I'm in a conference. This is the reason why it is powerful to honor all men because you don't know what part of their growth imagine the person who greeted Obasanjo the last time before he came out of prison if that was a wise man he would greet him and give him how many plates of food and say eat sir i'm the chef here eat it's painful to miss your lifting because of lack of discernment just because you see that brother sitting down and his shoe looks like it's not a testimony his mind has gotten it his mind is in a boutique shopping for the higher version of him just because the preacher laid hands on 50 people and nobody got healed he left that meeting like a funeral what happened did you really call me oh god he prophesied every word of knowledge was wrong you felt bad for him and said why didn't you just preach and sit down while he was doing that the prophet accessing the depths of the spirit three years later you step into a meeting and remember him just when you are about to laugh like before he calls your name no once upon a time peter i could not heal the epileptic patient but now my shadow I will not always remain an amateur there is growth in the spirit rejoice not over my yesterday that laughter will embarrass you tomorrow rejoice not over my yesterday please sit down 